Hi guys, happy homebrew Wednesday. Just a really quick one to show you the results of my triple hop homebrew ale. It's been in the bottle now for just over two and a half weeks, so if you haven't seen my video of the brew day, please check it out. And if you, you can pick up the recipe there as well if you'd like to give it a go. So it was basically a Cooper's amber ale, just hot with three different hops, Citra, Cascade and Amarillo. So let's get out of the bottle. Maybe just see a bit of that smoke coming up there, I don't know. Let's give it a pour. Yep, Citra Cascade and Amarello with a base of a Cooper's Amber Ale kit. It's basically all that went into it. Well, there's a little bit of carapels as well. It's a really nice colour. Um, let's give it a sniff. Yeah, it's classic kind of tropical floral smells, citrusy. It's a uh, this one doesn't seem to have a great head on it to me, but I can assure you it is well carbonated. It's a lovely colour. So I just have a sniff. Yeah, not you can't really smell an awful lot of malt there. It's it's very uh very fruity. Um so let's give it a quick taste. Yeah, it's really nice hop. It's really nice. It's um, it's nice and light. It's, it's I'd almost say it's like you're getting a pub. To be honest with you, it's it's not. Some brews are obviously very malty, and you get a lot of grain flavours. And this just tastes great. It's, you can taste the malt. Um, nice bit of lace in there. It's pretty pretty clear as well. You can see the bottom of the glass there reflecting. But yeah, it's nice and light. It's uh, very refreshing. Very sessionable. It was uh, it came out at 4.4% ABV in the end. I think there was a starting, well, original gravity 1041, the final gravity was 1008. So yeah, 4.4% and I had an IBU on that 35. So it's... Um, Probably one of the better ones to be honest with you. It's really, I mean, I've only made five or six brews, but that that's very nice. Yeah, nice, nicely carbonated. Batch prime that. So, um, so yeah, nice creamy head. Slightly, I say cream. It's it is fading a bit, that, but I can see soon get that head going. It's an off-white, kind of slightly beigey head. You can see there, it's, it's a lovely colour and it tastes superb as well. So that's the main thing. I think I'd, um, I do think I'd brew that again, definitely. It was only a 11.5 litre batch I think, so but anyway, just a quick one from me, so thanks a lot and I'll speak to you soon. Bye.